All right. This is the legendary Jake Busey. Jake, catch us up on what's going on. Oh, man, it's the Oscars 2016. We're here to have a grand old time. We're going to have a good dinner, watch the show, which I believe is about to start, so we better get in there and get ourselves some dinner. picture? Oh, I'd, I'd love to see the Martian get it. Get it. I mean, I, I, I love Ridley Scott, and I love the Scott Bros. I, I love Matt. I love that. The whole, the whole gang was great. It was a, it's such an amazing film. Big short. That was, wow, what a cast. Man, Bale did it. Just a kick-ass job. Carell did it. I mean, it was amazing, you know. It was one of those things I didn't know. Christian Bale was Christian Bale for half the movie, you know. It was, it was so good. But you know, this this is uh, this is a good year. Um, the only unfortunate part about it is there's no diversity. There's no diversity, you know. And um, and you got to say uh, you, we got to take a look at who's who's in that little group that's voting for the movies and the actors, you know, because. Uh, Sometimes I think as human beings, part of our nature, no matter who, what race you are, no matter what color you are, part of our nature is to associate with things that are familiar to us and similar to us because it's instinctual, it's, it's, it's programmed, it's hardwired into our brains for survival from the caveman days. So when you've got these old people that are closed-minded, they're kind of... They're just sticking to things that are similar to them subconsciously, and it's, it's something that, that's why when you hear people say, let's raise awareness, that's the deal. Yes, let's raise awareness. Let's say, hey, remember to go outside of your comfort bubble, outside of your familiarity zone, and look at what's not similar to you. And look, and look at the, you know. It calls for better social integration, oh, right? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Social Absolutely. Social integration. Culturally, I mean, you, you learn so much from cultural diversity. Why be closed off to it? So that's unfortunate this year, but uh, you know, nonetheless, maybe next year will be better. I gotta ask you before you go. What was the favorite character you played of all time? Because I can think of a number of them. But the favorite character I played of all time I it might be you. Kyle Brenner. <laughs> Kyle Brenner might, might be my favorite. I like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, sir, have a great time. All right, thank great you. Great to see you. All right, good to see you.